Okay, we have our first question tucked way in the corner here. We're gonna do a couple of audience questions now. Yes, ma'am. So as a breast cancer survivor, I have had two diagnoses at the same time. The scariest part for me was ending treatment and being mm. sent out on your own. What right. do you tell your patients as they end treatment of how they can stay on the 60% side of not getting it again rather than the 40% chance of getting it again? I think the number is coming down though, so there's good news there on Yay. the recurrence rates. But I do have an entire chapter 10 dedicated to life after treatment. And what I would suggest to you and to any woman who's ever been affected by this disease is to follow my 60 seconds. I want you to get back into all of the things that I say will help contribute to preventing breast cancer. You can truly prevent all of it. Whatever I say to do there in terms of diet, nutrition, alcohol, obesity, exercise, et cetera, is going to help reduce or even prevent a recurrence. And then one of the things that's largely neglected, I think, in medical literature is the um, there's no emphasis on social support and love and connectedness. But there is data to show that people live happier, healthier, and longer when they have love in their lives. Great. Thank you so much. Thank you.